Hello everybody and welcome back to another video by me, Steve Clues. Right now today I've got this hydro pod here. Now this is a plant pot that's self-watering and also got a built-in light at the top, which is quite cool. And this is USB powered with the lighters and all. Let's show you the description here. So it's ideal for. And um, this is a few different things here what it says at the back. If you want to pause the video you can. Now this comes with the cables all and it's USB Type-C and I'll let's set it up. Now the idea is basically this comes out here. Now this is where you fill the water, put the water in there and it's actually got a maximum there. So don't, don't fill the water past that thing otherwise it'll overflow then properly, not work properly. Also, as well, is make sure, obviously, you put the plant in here, in this pot here, not in there, because otherwise it won't work. Then, obviously, once you've got the plant in there, you put it in like that, then, obviously, you plug this into the USB, and just basically leave it. And, obviously, there you plug the USB port there, USB Type-C. Then it automatically light up and then water. Um, they recommended on the book itself, it does say, don't leave it on the light for more than 16 hours. Hopefully turn the light off because otherwise it probably, I don't know, it probably kill the plant. And all this adjusts them all. It was down like that. It's adjusts the height you want it to see, so that's quite good. It's adjusted to the light you want it, the height you want it so we, it's quite cool and my idea of this is I'm going to put this bonsai tree here into here and hopefully it'll make it come back to life again I don't know but that's, that's my idea and, I've, and this part here is basically the sensor for the when, it's, when it needs watering it'll basically it comes out through here basically And also, to t obviously, it needs to be plugged in at USB all the time. So, you know, recommended that you have it next to something USB like that, like I've got it here. I've got USB ports here on, on the socket. It's recommended that you have it plugged in like that. And it's on. Yeah. I mean, it's all for small plants, but I mean, this would be good for herbs. Or well, like little small plants like bonsai tree, like that. That would probably do alright. But this the ideal for this is basically, obviously, because if I've got this here, I mean, it's good for small plants, but obviously you can't use it for big plants. But once it's grown so big, you can take it out of here and transfer it back to there. So, yeah. So now I'm going to transfer this into here. Thank you. 